Hey everybody, this is Eric Clark's Travel Videos and I'm here in Budapest and I'm going to the Central Market today. It's the big huge shopping market and all the spices and paprika and everything else. Um, and it's right here behind me. It's got the colored roofs behind me and uh, we're going to go take a look and go shopping. Okay, bye-bye. So, I didn't mean to say goodbye, but that's okay. So this is Vaki Street. Vasi Street. This is the street I live on. So if you go that way about a mile, I think it's a mile, uh, maybe close, maybe half a mile, you get to my house. And this is like a huge, long, crazy street. But this is the Central Market, and this is where we're going today. Or at least one of the stops today. And it's a little overcast. And this is right on a bridge, too, so that's cool. Um... And what's it say? La Zamu Vasakar Sarnok. Yeah, I have no idea. It's right next to a Burger King now. But it does have amazing roofs. And it's an amazing building. Um, and I have... Well, I guess we'll go see what we're going to get. Good. Thank you. All right. Wow. Yeah, it's a big market, isn't it? So one of the things that Budapest is known for is its paprika. Well, let's just walk down the center street or center <laughs> center. Aisleway, pathway, cartway, I mean, it's as big as a street almost. It's a freeway in Italy. Um, yeah, paprika, 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 all sorts of different types of paprika. I mean, everything is paprika, paprika. Big paprikas, geez. Wow. Paprika Central. So I don't know what the difference is on the sides here. On the left, it looked like there was a bunch of fruits and vegetables, but there's a bunch of fruits and vegetables here too. Um, hey, and they have meat here too. I'm gonna buy some meat. I had a stir fry last night with no meat. I went to the grocery store. Everything on the shelf was outdated by at least three or four days. And some of the things looked pretty scary, but, uh, but this looks much better, I think. We'll see. It looks like there's an upstairs too, maybe? I, I don't know. There are upstairs, actually. So. Sausages and salamis. Mm. Maybe that and some crackers and some uh, hummus. Mm. Or mustards. Okay, I'm kind of hungry. <laughs> Yeah, this is a big building. And they do have lots of meats here, so that's amazing. And they've got juices, fresh juices. Aldi, okay. So there's a grocery store here too. Um, okay, this must be the, <laughs> the fish aisle. I hate to say it. Uh, oh, maybe this is... Is there more to it this way? No? I'm just telling you that uh, it smells like a fish factory. Hmm. And there's like three of these rows, so they're, they're certainly, it's, it's certainly a big building. You can't even see the end of this. So it's, it's pretty big. Uh, and I'm gonna get some apples too. So apples are 1480. I don't know what. I, I, obviously, that's forint Hungary, Hungarian money. 498. Oh, maybe the the 
pears are $14.80. The apples are $4.98. And I'm thinking that might be a pound. I don't know. Wonderful looking tomatoes, though. Wow, that's amazing. Wow. <laughs> you want to buy some, I guess, fat? Hmm. And radishes, strawberries. Hmm. Wow. Okay, now I'm going to have to go home and cook a meal. <laughs> Oh, I guess this is the deal place here. There's a big crowd here, so maybe she has better product. I don't know. No hands. Don't touch. They'll serve you, so you can't serve yourself. I think they do everything for you. So. Huh. Oh, my gosh. My dream come true. <laughs> 4000 Four thousand forint for a liter of uh, cucumber. I just had the Chinese food last night, the stir fry. It was really good, but I found curry, so we'll have to find uh, more stuff around here and see what we get. I wonder what this place looks like on weekends. I bet it's pretty crazy. Wow, and look at those vegetables. Is that amazing? Wow. You know, I'm gonna have to stop and take a picture now. Cause that's pretty amazing. You know, that's a, that's a screen thing on my, or uh, Never mind. <laughs> All right. Well, I think that you've seen enough to know what we're dealing with here. Um, so now it's time to go shopping for paprika. I guess what I'm going to see if I can find is somebody who speaks English who can give me a paprika lesson. That's it, everybody. Um, thanks for coming with me to the Central Market in Budapest. Bye, everybody.